What's going on guys? We are back once again for a, another review and I figure I'd go ahead and g just want to talk about more shows that I obviously enjoy and this is going to be another show that I absolutely enjoyed growing up and again I may get mixed reviews for this but again I don't care. I love this show growing up. Uh, it was Roseanne and I remember watching this all the time when I was little and even now, you know, with the repeats on or whatever. I remember watching this all the time. I remember laughing so hard. I remember just having having a good time, man. And this was an old show. I mean, it really was. And I know a lot of people, they have their own feelings towards whether it be the actors or the uh, the whole necessary of the show. But again, if you never watch the show and you want something funny, go check this out and give it a chance. It is worth it. Um, it is basically, uh, you have Roseanne Barr playing Roseanne herself. You got John Goodman playing Dan Connor, her husband. And then three kids. You got, uh, of course, you got DJ, you got Darlene, you got Becky, all these ones. And even um, we got Jackie Harris, who plays Roseanne's sister. And then also you got uh, Johnny Galecki when he played David, who was Darlene's love interest, which is way before he even got on Big Bang Theory. And this this shows how just different things with a middle class family. And that's something that I know a lot of people, especially nowadays, either will not understand or don't understand or will understand about all the hardships of uh, middle class. I mean, it, it really goes into a lot of different things that I think not a lot of shows show now because either they're scared or they want to bend the knee or they want to like you know basically screw around with it and they don't want to get to the root of the problem because there's a lot of shows that didn't talk about certain things that um that this show talked about especially within the time era that the show first aired and they they talked about you know um pregnancy they talked about you know birth control they talked about racism they talked about um uh mediocrity they, they they talked about you know what's more important paying your phone bill or paying your car bill or, or or your you know your electric or the food what was more important and also how hard it is at times to get a job and also um with your kids getting married so young and how do you deal with that or one of your family members having a disease or someone going to jail that you know or any kind of abuse in a uh, relationship or any kind of controlling in a relationship or anything from uh, har harassment at work or uh, you know a death in the family of a parent or any kind of random stuff that's what this show really it brought it really brought a lot of real life scenarios in the world of this show and a lot of people enjoyed that a lot of people did not enjoy that now was this show perfect no it was not it did have its issues over time the show lost its flair out in my opinion and there was episodes that was absolutely stupid there was episodes that was absolutely hilarious and i miss the old roseanne i really do i miss the older roseanne where it was just fun crazy times and then later on it just became crazy and it didn't make no sense like you know when they got the money it made no sense and then you had the you had Roseanne continuing slash the Connors that they continued and that part didn't make sense so I'm gonna make another video on but overall I think this show was great and you know I, again it's one of my favorite shows growing up it was it, it still is there's episodes that I'm not a fan of it's kind of cringy kind of stupid and I just skip over those because when you're young you know you don't really pay attention but then you get older and you're like ah, no I don't like stuff so so much and then you just go on to the next one or whatever and, and, and that happens you know there's certain episodes that you really don't understand you know what I mean it just it gets really more crazy but either way I think Roseanne is still a great show uh, it has its faults but at the same time it's still a great show but if you guys have never watched Roseanne go give it a try you will not be disappointed you'll still have a lot of laughs you'll have some crying involved you'll have uh, some probably anger moments involved but either way it's still a great show great acting great drama great just you know life uh, about life man I mean it's still a great show to not only watch with your family your kids 
in anyone, you know, uh, just, just have an open mind. I mean, that's really all I can say is have an open mind and have fun watching just an old school funny comedy. But let me know what you guys think about it down in the comments down below. If you guys are new channel, subscribe subscribing. The big fat like on the video, guys enjoyed. Hope you guys enjoyed. What do you guys think of our Do you guys enjoy it? Do you guys love it? Hate it? Please let me know down in the comments. Let's have a great conversation. And I'll see you guys next time.